Lord. So, the lion, the ferocious lion, jumped in front of them. So, here now. Keep calm. One of the explorers like, keep calm. Remember what we read in the book of, about the wild animals? When you, when there is something like that, you just stand and keep still. And then, if you look, uh, if you look at the if you look on the eye, if you look the lion on the eye, the lion will turn and run. Sure. We read, yeah, I know, he said. We read the book. I read the book. You read the book. But did the lion read the book? <laughs> sometimes, <laughs> sometimes, even we read already, Jesus promised us already many, many promises in the Bible. But still we doubt, right? Still we doubt. Ellen White advises, when we are encompassed with doubt, perplexed by circumstances, or afflicted by poverty or distress, Satan seeks to shake our confidence in Jehovah. But God understands if you will peace and love. He reads the motives and the purpose of the heart. That's a good promise. To wait patiently, to trust when everything looks dark, is the lesson that the leaders in God's work need to learn. Heaven will not fail them in the day of adversity. I like that statement. Nothing is apparently more helpless, yet really more invincible than the soul that feels is nothing less and relies only on God. I like the song of Ria, it shows this one. Putting not my will, but your will. Putting everything to God. It is when we surrender ourselves to God that God will help us. The last one. Wind. Troubles and storms of life. A uh, big shirt hits, Junior says, everyone is either coming out of a storm, in a storm, or hidden for a storm. You know the song, with Christ in my desert, I can smile as a storm. Yeah. Nothing to be afraid as long Jesus is in the vessel, as long we are in the right track, as long we have the faith in Jesus, there's nothing. Yeah. You know, if you're in the vessel, uh, I usually, when I was studying in Mount Village, I only went home twice. First year, second year, went home. After two years, as if I went abroad. And then another two years again. Third year, fourth year, then I went home after graduation. Only twice. Yeah, because no money. <laughs> okay, now, I, I didn't take the plane. It's not that expensive. I only uh, ride on the boat. Okay, in the boat, sometimes, you know those who went to the cruise? Uh, Tina, right? You sometimes feel you, you, you feel busy, as you said, but I don't feel busy. I enjoy the life when you're in the boat. Yeah, sometimes, especially if, I'm sorry, especially if there is a big wave, something like that. Yeah, it, it kind of moves you, something like that, it's way. But then, as long you are inside the vessel, you are safe. Don't go out from the vessel, <laughs> else you will die. As long as you are inside, you are safe. With Christ in my vessel, I can smile at the storm. I found something very interesting about this musical tone. The difference in the musical tone of a violin depends mostly on the quality of the wood. It is made of, oh, I thought it's just violin. Uh, I thought those who are playing violin who are very skillful. I thought, oh, they're violin, they are very good in violin. It sounds like the sound sometimes, it depends on the kind of wood. It's a kind of instrument that you are using. It's not really, oh, you're good. Yeah, you're, you're good. But then, it, it also, the, the wood also, I mean, the material also, it will add to that one, okay? The best violin maker in the world cannot make a good instrument from poor material. It means they are choosing what material they are making for their violin. And I found out a famous violinist always made his own instrument. Oh, they even make their own violin instrument because he wanted to choose a special kind of wood. He shunned the forest, but went instead to the mountains. Not in the forest, into the mountains. Okay, there are the top of the cliff, exposed to all the storm. He obtained these trees. So he's going to choose a tree where it is something really worth there. It is exposed to the storms and like that. He knew that if 
severe weather conditions toughen the wood. So the more severe weather toughen the wood, it's just like bamboo. Have you seen it? Do you have bamboo here? Bamboo. Bamboo wood? Bamboo. No? No, I have a do we have bamboo here? No, I have it. Oh yeah, we don't have it. Yeah, in the Philippines, a bam. Hmm? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, in in Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, the weather it will just it sways the bamboo, right? But then it it stood, it always stand up. It's just like the the coconut tree also, yeah. Okay. In fact, he used only the wood from the side of the tree facing the wind. Also, he uses the, the kind of wood for facing the, facing the wind. Thus, too, but the storm of adversity. Thus, our loving Father prepare us. Prepare in us the music of heaven. So that is we are being prepared to. So in our lives, if there's a lot of wind, storms, you know the storms, okay? It means we are being prepared. We are being toughened, okay? Because... God has not promised. His God is always true. Flowers, strong pathways, all our life true. God has not promised sun without rain, joy without sorrow, peace without pain. But God has promised His strength for the day, rest for the labor, life for the way, grace for the trials, help from above, unfailing sympathy, and dying love. What a very nice promise. Well, I just finished my intro too late, that's why it's somewhat poetic. <laughs> when the storms of life assail us, let's call on him and he would immediately be by our side. When he cannot when we cannot see what is ahead of us, let us trust him. Yeah, many times in our life we want to see what I cannot understand. When we first came here, the first three months, we didn't get the job. Oh Lord, I applied to this one, I applied everywhere, but nobody is answering, nobody is responding. And then, and then we end up really crying. Lord, you brought us here. We do not have any job, what shall we do? So please, if I cannot see what is ahead, uh, I will trust you, I will trust you. But let me see the beauty of it later help me to 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 appreciate it it means help me see the blessing after it because every time there is always a purpose for everything i i i, I, I always have that in mind yeah. and now i realize that god is allowing those things to happen because god is a, has a better plan for me when we cannot see what is ahead of us let us trust him for us our pilot and guides he never makes mistakes now I want you to read this with me. Let's have some reading. Okay? He make it when he start. He make it no mistakes. My father's way may twist and turn. My heart may drop and be. But in my soul, I'm glad I know. He make it no mistake. My cherished plans may go astray. My hopes may fade away. But still I trust my Lord to lead, for he does know the way. Though the night be dark, and it may seem the day will never break, I'll pin my faith, my all in him, he maketh no mistake. There's so much I cannot see, my eyes are far too dim. But come what may, I'll simply trust and leave it all to him. For by and by the mist will live, and plain it all he'll make. Through all the way, though dark to me, he make it no mistake. It's a very good promise. He make it no mistake. If we only put just put our trust in him, and he will lead us to the right way. Now this time I'll let you read. I want you to sing also. <laughs> Uh, Justin, I, I think you need to well, this one so it will work. <coughs> okay? Trust his heart. I like this song so much. And let us reflect the message of this song. 
putting our trust to God. Let's sing this song together. Just click that one.